the viral video of a weatherman flawlessly pronouncing a Welsh town that has 58 letters that no one else seems to be able to pronounce. Imagine having to have that on your business sign or soccer team banner. But its meaning is even longer. The Church of Mary in the Hall of the White Hazel near the Fierce Whirlpool and the Church of St. Ticilio of the Red Cave. Okay. But that's nothing compared to the world's longest name. Takes this guy 25 seconds to say the name. It has 85 letters. We had to get a New Zealander to help with this pronunciation. Matia Pokai Finua Kitana Tahu. That's a mouthful. It is, it is, and yeah, hopefully I pronounced it right, otherwise I don't want to be embarrassing anyone back in New Zealand. <laughs> and it means the summit where Tamatea, the man with big knees, the climber of mountains, the land swallower who traveled about, played his nose flute to his loved one, whatever a nose flute is. But Canada also has one of the world's longest names coming in at 31 letters. Uh, Pekwach Namai Koskwaskai. Pekwak Namai Good try, but not quite. The native pronunciation is... It's the name of a lake in Manitoba. It sure is a big letters. <laughs> <laughs> and it means where the wild trout are caught by fishing with hooks, which would be easier to say. Canadian place. No, it's not. I don't believe you. <laughs> Do you know how to say no. it? <laughs> and so I guess I should consider myself lucky that I only have to say Audra Brown in Toronto. The easy to spell, easy to say for City News.